Hello, everybody. Thank you all for coming in. We are slowly starting. Um, ooh, let me fix that. I'm still, I got a new webcam. So as you can see, I'm a little bit more clear here today. And we are now at 1080p. No more, because uh, my, my laptop actually, the camera was, um, what was that, 720, right? And, and I actually noticed it when I was doing, um, you know, when I, I, was, I, I was actually doing my shorts, I was trying to do a short from, from one of my live streams, and I noticed that the picture was like a little, little like blurry and all that. Not blurry, but like fuzzy. All right. Okay. Let me say hello to everybody. We all got to wait about maybe five, 10 minutes so people start to come in. And let's see who's uh, on uh, Instagram. Kristen with Kristen. Thank you. Um, for joining in as you know she was already on this live one time and jen zika photo underscore thank you also for joining in and i want to thank my mother-in-law for coming in josephine rulo my mother's here nancy and cruising jk is here and we do have five people here so everybody and there's two others who obviously they don't want to say hello they are Ghosts, they are ghosts right now. And we actually do have a big weekend coming up. So for those of you who don't know, this weekend is actually St. Patrick's Day weekend. So obviously I'm not wearing green because I'm a bad Irish person. I don't have, I'm not even kidding you. I have no green shirts at all. <clears throat> I, I honestly just don't like wearing green shirts. I, I don't think they're, they're good. <clears throat> I actually think that those green shirts are actually a lot of green shirts like they don't match with clothes and all of that so it's like I look at the green shirts I'm like what why would I wanna actually wear it you know like yeah and plus I'm wearing lime a lime green or a or neon orange shirt every day so for work obviously that's what happens when you're in construction you have to wear those Neon shirts are there. Okay. So let me actually, which I did not do, I failed at this. I'm going to share this um, live stream real quick, which is I was actually having an issue with the with, uh, YouTube thing. That, that's why I, I got on. I rushed to get on here because I was, I was talking to him. For some reason, I have a store, and all it has is the Cruising with Keith logo on it, and they won't approve it. I'm not even kidding when I tell you. They will not approve my store right now. So I'm going to have to. Oh, I'm going to see. Uh, okay, I was just reading the stuff. Yeah, so I'm going to have to actually, um, you know, maybe put my, my old store up for now until they approve it. I mean, they're, they're, not, letting, they're not letting me, uh, you know, have you know, I'll put my store. I, that store has a lot of merchandise, and it just has a Cruise McKeith logo. It's not like I have a, a YouTube logo, a TikTok logo, some other logo. It's just a Cruise McKeith logo. That's it. I didn't add nothing extra to it. For some reason, they will not let me, you know, have it. I mean, and I spoke to them, and they now they say, I mean, you can't. I wish I could just call them up. You can't even call them up. You got to talk to them, and then if you, after you talk to them, they send me to another website, and on there, I have to send an email. It's just like a pain in the neck, right, to actually get in touch with these people sometimes. Okay, now, yeah, I'm a little, so, okay, so let me uh, actually share this real quick on all my social medias which will take like two seconds so today i have some some news to talk about cruise news oh lord i just xed everything out before thank god i mean x out the live stream i cannot believe it i literally just xed out the entire um well my news um yeah so now i have to go back and get it back up which will take a take a quick second but then i wrote down actually the, the new stories i want to talk about which actually is a really good thing uh all right so so i wrote because i was right down 
you usually I write out the whole stories, but now I, I'm actually going to send me, save me from writing a lot, lot less. Um, and obviously I save paper that way, you know, we'll do that. So now, I mean, okay. So we got six people in here. Oh, and the channel is actually doing pretty good. If you don't know, I'm over the 3000 hour mark. So if you see on the bottom right of your screen, there's something called a sticker or something. I don't, I mean, to, I don't understand it. So that's like, a, I really don't understand these stickers, the bumper stickers, but you have to, you can't do it through Instagram. So you got to come onto the YouTube, you know, Twitter, just come onto YouTube and if you click, I think it's like $2, five, I mean, it's just like, I have no clue what it is. I have yet to see it done, you know, obviously on me. So, but I have no clues, but it, when it's just there and that's it. So what did you have for dinner? So for dinner, okay, bef let me get to the chat real quick from the beginning. So let me say hello to Josephine. Oh, <laughs> I just felt like a pain in my knee for a second. Uh, I would never feel that like 20 years ago. My Nancy's here, cruising JK, stalkers, yes. Most of people in here are my family, but I, I guess as soon as I kind of screwed up today, I never made this live during the week because usually I make, I make the live like a week before I put out, but I've just been so busy. Or and oh, yeah, so if you don't know. know um, obviously you knew I was in the hospital. I just did my sleep study last night. It was actually a really, really comfortable sleep. I was surprised. So basically, you know, you got to put the thing over here and everything's wired up. You have a wristband that you got to wear, which has like, like something over here. And then I have to have something on my finger. It goes like this. You just got to press it in there and it's going to detect everything. But now that's, uh, Something that now I have to go back to the doctor in April. For some reason, I don't understand. I do that. It's connected to my phone, connected to the internet right away. But yet, it takes three weeks to for them to two or three weeks for them to get the results. It makes absolute no sense to me. I understand. Okay, it's six hours. So to do the results, and maybe you got to do it a couple of times. It shouldn't take maybe a week at most. It should not take that long, you know? But this is just how it is, you know? Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Ma, your wife will match it for you. Yeah, that's my clothes. Being Irish is a vibe, not a color. Yes, it is. I, let's see, oh, let me check. Yeah. I love being Irish. I love being Italian. LOL. What did you have for dinner, Casey? So for dinner today, I had um, those uh, sausage wheels, right, with mashed potatoes and uh, corn. And I mean, you know, you know it's funny now. Let's talk about corn. It's like I grew up. I loved cream stock corn. I loved. Cream stock corn, even after I got married. Over the past maybe a year, that all changed. I just didn't want any of that extra cream and all that. Now it's just regular corn. I put it in the mashed potatoes. I, st I still put it in the mashed potatoes because that's something I always like to do. And that's it. Ten minutes in. And who, oh, Lord, have mercy on me. I mean, it's, it's got to be, see, it's got to be other people coming in but whatever people will watch after um let me say hello to i am cruising has joined and stress so has joined uh stress so which is someone i know from the old neighborhood okay well obviously people will be watching the replay so they're gonna miss out on the on the chat the live news everything they get out there so which is weird, but whatever. It is what it is. So everybody, you know, there's only the four of us right now. I'm, su I'm surprised. 
it's definitely a beautiful night. So maybe because of the weather, because, but you know, that's in New York. I mean, a lot of people come in here usually from like around the world and everywhere. Oh, let's, I did that again. Okay. Nah. It says it's a beautiful night tonight. So let me see. Uh, this is tomorrow. Okay. So it's actually a really, really, really big uh, new story, right? Which I'm uh, I'm gonna go over the some of my cruise news which I put out this week. But before I do that, I'm gonna tell you what my channel is actually doing because I like to give everybody an update on the channel. How is it going? So, so today, actually, right now, I in one of my, one of my videos, I have 56 views in the last hour, and that video is up to wow. Uh, I mean, it's, that video is up to 913 views right now, if you can see that, and the watch time hours, 20, 21 hours. So, someone people spent 21 hours to watch me. Just remember that. And I, I have videos of, I have other videos that even are, are even fur, higher than that. I mean, I, I get happy if I get like, you know, anywhere between five to like 15 hours. That's what I'm trying to do. Because my goal is, so I have 10 weeks until the cruise, right? So I want to get the 4,000 watch hours in those 10 weeks, right? So how am I going to do that? I need 100 hours a week of watch hours. Because once that happens, then, you know, the channel is going to start to take off a little bit further. Because right now, we are growing. And if you don't believe me, I'm going to run down my, not the latest video, because it just came out yesterday, right? I'm not going to talk. Because usually, it's weird. When I put out the videos, it takes about a day and a half, then people start watching. I just don't understand the algorithm. I put it out. It usually don't go right away. Sometimes later the next day. Not later the next day, the following day. Then that day is when it actually does go out, right? So on, on the videos for some reason. Okay, so I have, which is the one I just showed you, which is that 900 and something, right? So I have the video before that, which is 363. The one before that one was at 1600. Before that one, 370. So the, so the videos are actually starting to grow, and now I'm seeing the trend of it. Obviously, you know, I had like three videos before that that was under 100. But then before that, I was at 643. And then the two before, and obviously the couple before that is when I was in the hospital. Ah. So, so, cruising with Kristen came over from the Instagram onto the Facebook. I know Facebook, YouTube. Oh, my God, I'm losing my mind. Onto the YouTube. So, Thank you for joining in, cruising with Chris. Oh, wrong one. You jump. Thank you for joining in, cruising with Chris. Which ship are you on next? Me and my niece are heading, headed on the Liberty of the Seas. So my next ship is the Carnival Horizon. That's in 10 weeks. And the one after that, I will be on the celebration. So it is, and they both leave out of Miami. So one's an eight day, one's a seven day, which is going to be awesome. Because you know what's going to actually going to be pretty cool is when I'm getting on the horizon, I'm going to see the icon of the seas, right? When I get on the horizon, and you know, Joseph Rule, put your mom on the live. I my mother's at my brother's house right now, so what? You know what? I mean, two weeks I was thinking about canceling my live. Yeah, maybe I, I'll try to figure something out because I'm actually going to my mother's house on Good Friday because my mother likes to do potato pancakes. You know, maybe I just go there and just bring her in on, on the live. I don't know. I mean, I'm going to put a poll out there. Actually, not now. Maybe I'll put a poll on, on the channel and it says, on Good Friday, should I bring Nancy Kowalski on the live? Let me know. Josephine, L O O. Joanne K. Hello, everybody. Yes, that's my moderator and my my wife. Uh, if you don't know, so yeah. So again, there. Uh, okay. So I'm trying to figure. So okay, there's a thing on the. If you look, uh, what's this? Ah. Uh, so, 
make you okay that's what that is okay oh so that's gonna be you know, so facebook i'm gonna use you on there that's gonna be uncle yui that's me it's well it's one of my my, my mother's brothers uncle yui uncle donald uncle dennis welcome to me so one of the four <clears throat> so yeah she would definitely love it i i will ask her so oh as long as she's not as uh, as long as she's not camera shy sure my mom has been on my channel before yummy actually you know it's fun if you go to my carnival venencia ones right i think i have uh, she was on actually the inaugural cruise with me so on that inaugural cruise we were there right but if so, so talk about that now, Chris. If you go to EECC, right, those are like the the big YouTubers, right? And if you look at when his wife is doing like the walkthroughs of, of, of the cruise and all that, my mother ends up in like a bunch of videos of it. There's one time she's she's like passed out. I'm, I'm not even kidding. She's sleeping by the pool and, and they got her on camera. I'm not even kidding. I mean, I saw it. We, we were all laughing about it. You know, it's just something that was funny. Then there was another time where you, you see my wife and my wife and my mother and this lady's husband, because me and this lady, me and the lady went up to go get a drink. So, so you can actually see both. So you can see them three there, and so you can see my big, my big gorilla, mo <laughs> you know, ass up there and doing all that. So okay, so. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna get to what I was gonna talk about. So let's get to the the news. I mean, I am gonna start to change it up. I mean, if you want me to do it? Uh, I told my wife I would do it. So I'm gonna. So what I'm gonna be doing on my lives now is, you know how I go crazy with the cruise news. If you ever watch any of my actual um, cruise news videos, well, on my lives. Now what I'm gonna do is maybe maybe I'll, I'll just get like a, a recording. I'll record something maybe like me seeing that. Or I'll, I'll just do a live. So I haven't decided that. Well, I'm gonna go. Guess what time it is, guys? It's cruise news time. And then now there we go. The news. <laughs> I, I hope you all had a little laugh at that. So I'm gonna talk about some cruise news that I already spoke about this week. So it's also a way to get people to watch the video and all that so if you don't know uh where are you right here and if you're not familiar there was actually an outbreak of the norovirus this week another outbreak of the norovirus so we had this is the third time this year <laughs> the muster is here yes the muster thank you <laughs> and he's so see i go it's cruise news time and, and he's probably in his house waking uh, driving his wife crazy uh screaming out cruise news you know so i just had to do it and you know obviously um let's see oh yeah so if you guys missed the um i actually heard um i, I heard it this morning where scott was talking about me, me dancing on the live. I mean, I'm not much of a dancer. Like back in the day, I, I used to dance with like the glow sticks. I used to rave back in the day, who, which is crazy. So one of these, these days, I'm gonna make a live with like the techno. I'll go back and get the glow sticks, but I'm not gonna go too crazy because, you know, I want to be able to walk after. <laughs> so okay, so let's get to this. So I have this video which I had made already this week. So. Uh, uh, actually, I have a pitch, a photo of the ship up here for you guys. Okay, so I'm going to show this. So so on the Holland America, um, I cannot pronounce that, but be my guess. It's called uh, Conandam. That's why I said Conandam, but it doesn't S. So I don't know if the S is silent because I if I have to go Conandam, I don't. It's Conandam. That's it. That's all I'm going to say. It is Conandam on that ship, right? So the, there was a normal virus outbreak on that ship this week. So I have a video of this. So please do go and watch the video, which you're going to get a more detailed, detailed story of it. 
all of the entire thing. So I'm going to talk about it, right, real quick. And on there, there, there was 110 passengers and crew, right? So I know uh, of the passengers, it's a little over than 1% and the crew. No, the passengers are a little over 3% and the crew is like 1%. So this is a major, I mean, this is something that happens on average. Obviously, this year, what we've been seeing, maybe like once a month on average right now. Okay, okay. Josephine says, hi, mustard drill. Oh, please, LOL. Yeah, so, so this is something that's real serious. I mean, so a lot of times, you know, you know, I mean, I've been on the cruise ship where, you know, I might have had the norovirus. I was, I felt a little sick from um, peppers. So, but when I went back the second time, this was on the Venetia. Then when I went back the second time, I made sure I got nothing from that station with the peppers and I was fine. So maybe I just, you know, it just wasn't fair for me, the peppers. So I just stood away from it. Um, as soon as I stood away from that, then I knew not to get it. The, you know, the peppers. I mean, I usually don't eat peppers, so it's like, you know, that's also not that. I'm not a big spice person, pepper person. I can't do that. <laughs> I'm sorry. My throat guy. Sorry about that. Um. Oh, actually, you know what? I'm going to my brother's house tomorrow. Oh, I mean, I don't need music. I, I'll get the music for you guys. I'll put it in the background and all that. That's what I should do. So... So that's what I should do. I should get some glow sticks tomorrow. Maybe a, a, it's gotta be at nighttime because the reason why you gotta do at night because you you know you want to be you want to see the glow sticks like move around and maybe I could uh, maybe I get my wife to uh, record me. You know uh, that would be perfect. Oh, you know get someone to record me. So yeah uh, yeah there goes my mother. Still. Tell me as we get older. As we get older, we can't eat a lot. Okay, so there's a if you want to go viral, get John's dog and the show and do a voiceover. Bingo viral. Oh, no glow sticks, yeah. So that's actually not bad. Let's see you on Instagram. Uh, Instagram, thank you um, for watching Vanilla Me Travels, Travels, and Ashley Ratliff. 520 has also joined. Thank you for joining. And Z Zella's, Zella's Light Travel has also joined on the Instagram side. So thank you for joining in. Yeah. Oh, see, that's what the mustard drill does. He will watch. He's not, you know, he'll, he'll say his hello and then he just like disappears. You know, but he's here. So I do know that. Oh, okay. So here's the. Well, we have 24 minutes. Okay. So now we're gonna get to the next story. So these are all like stories that I actually did. So you know, I made videos this week of it. So so that that's what happened. So I made videos of that one, the norovirus. Next one is actually this one that's actually actively going right now. It's get. I think it's going to hit over a thousand. Actually, it might hit over a thousand while we're actually doing thousand views while we're doing the show. So this is actually really good. Yeah, and let's see, let's see, where are we at? Nine hundred and thirty views on that on that one right now. Oh, Ocean Ocean Travel is here. Thank you for coming in. And do not. He's our travel agent. So if you ever need to uh, travel. Do contact him. He, he he does a lot of group cruises, so so he's actually a really really good travel agent. Okay, so do not forget to watch my videos this week. And okay, I'm gonna talk about my other video that I have, which is actually currently going on. So this is a when a 27 year old actually has died on the um. So a 27 year old died on a cruise ship, right? So they weren't seeing what cruise ship it was all week, you know, for, for, for like 24 hours, right? And uh, the other person, there was another person in that room who was like 32, right? I think 31 and 32 years old. But the 27-year-old died, and when they got to the, because cruise ship was going to Bahamas, and when they got to the Bahamas, they found um, actually cocaine in her stateroom. So they haven't said the cause of death, 
And the next day, they announced the ship, but it was um, Margaritaville at sea, but they were just writing down Margaritaville Paradise. My opinion is, I think the media was just trying to hide the ship because recently what happened on that ship is back in December, on that ship, a gun was smuggled in through through the port. So that that's the port of, of Palm Beach, right? So a gun is smuggled in through the port of Palm Beach onto the cruise that happened in December. And now cocaine just got smuggled in. And you know, I'm and I went off on the live. I mean not on the live. In the video, I go off, I go crazy because it's true. I said, what's gonna happen next? Someone's gonna come in with a bomb, whatever. Because so this is something that Customs has to deal with because what they do is on, on. I didn't know, but I know at this cruise port, customs isn't checking you going into the ship. They don't check you when you're coming into the country, but going on to ship, then they have a private company doing that for them. So that's something that we all have to like really, really, really think about and all that. Hey, hello, Facebook user. Um, so if you're on Facebook, it's not gonna say your name, so please just write in the comments your name if you're on the Facebook uh side. It just comes up as Facebook user. I wish one day they would actually fix that. There are certain things like about StreamYard that I do not like, but I do like a lot a lot of things, like for example, me doing this. Simple, you know. I'm able to have <clears throat> up to like you know, a million different, um, I can stream to a million different places at once. So I right now I'm streaming on Facebook, my Facebook group page, uh, TikTok, oh, not TikTok yet, no, no, uh, Twitter, I, I don't even know what it's called anymore. Now I still call it Twitter, Instagram. So, and once once I get the thousand, I'm going to find a way to do TikTok. So I need a thousand followers on there. I'm at like 600, like 30 something. So, I think within the next month or two, I could get that up to uh, a thousand. So I, I could stream from there too. So, because I, I, since TikTok has a big audience out there, I think once I start to stream from there, I think this channel is really, really going to start to grow once I do that. That's my opinion. But if it don't, it's a chance, you know? Yeah, but I am pushing a lot, a lot harder on the TikTok side. So I'll get to the 27. So my opinion is this. So let me get back to the cruise news story. So, so the drugs was found, but also all, all this stuff is getting smuggled in. And they were on actually a sit on a probation it's supposed to end in March. Right now, it's March. My opinion is, is they just got fire the company, high custom agents to actually do that, do their job and check the people going in because not for nothing. These people are going on to this cruise ship and something could happen. I mean, it's not like, you know, you know, something really, really bad could happen on this cruise ship. I mean, me personally, I would never, I wouldn't go on this cruise ship at all. But, but if I had to go on a cruise ship out of that port, I might think twice about it just because of a lot of things that have gone on. And, and to me, it's, I'm not, it's not about, oh yeah, that someone smuggled drugs. I'm not going to go on. I don't care if you are, doing drugs as long as it does bother me but the fact that they were able to smuggle a gun on board and the person came off the ship with the gun and that's how they got caught they got caught by custom agents coming off the cruise ship okay so that's that part of the news oh okay so now we got to the next one of my news stories which is here somewhere so yes, yeah, so, so if you don't you haven't seen it, this is my latest one. So please do go watch it. We gotta get the, this one to go, and we gotta get this one to go and grow, right? So three um actually um three cruise passengers on the Norwegian Sky actually went missing at the British Virgin Islands, and they are all. Uh, so if you don't, this cruise ship left from um La Romana. That's in the Dominican Republic. So, so if you don't know know about, about the cruise, so they about that cruise ship, it went to like a lot of islands over there. It was on a two week cruise, and at the last, what? Oh, I was weird. I just like heard something. Like it sounded like. <laughs> so, oh, that's what it was. It, it's probably this thing. 
So at the last port, right? I, um, it uh, what happened at the last port is they never got, came back onto the ship. So it was two women and a man, and they were both from Colombia. And my honest opinion, go watch the video, and you know, please don't forget to like and comment on it. But I believe that what really happened is they did not want to go back onto the ship on purpose so they figured they could just stay in the stay there and maybe um they could live a life there you know obviously but now they are in that country illegally and depending on on the country you know maybe you know they might go to jail so because now they're on the, they're not inside the, an american territory so maybe they do it they want the american virgin islands not the british virgin islands but now it's in it's the law of england so now it might be a little bit different <clears throat> for them over there so hey okay so here we go i feel like i'm hearing noises here right There we go. We are growing. <clears throat> oh, 940. We're just at, what did I say for? 930, 931. See, see how quickly? I, that's, it's just like that. I mean, that video was at 940, 20. I mean, if it keeps going like this tomorrow, I might even be, I might pass my, the one I just did the other day. So that's, that would be really good. A lot of watch hours. So we're trying to grow the watch hours. So, so, um, I did it on Monday, so I'm trying to do it. So right now, my actual watch hours are 3,053 watch hours. So, so I need another, what was that, 47 more within the next couple of days. So that would be really, really, really good. And let's see who else is here. Oh, nobody has came back onto Instagram. So I, and, okay, so who's here? You go, boy. Yep. So, technically, I know you need what? What is it? Forty-seven, nine hundred forty-seven hours more to go. That's it. But you know, so, I mean, there, there are days I wake up, I get like twenty hours, and the next day I get fat old zero now, because this is what happens when you get past that year where <clears throat> I got ten hours here, but last year I got. I got a ton, of, a 10 hours, so I lose those 10 hours from last year, so that's why I got some things, a big old zero. So, I mean, just tell me what you guys think. Do you think those people were trying to actually um, sneak into the country illegally? Because technically, they have all those ports to do that, but magically, they picked the last part. My opinion is they did, they were trying to. I wouldn't be surprised if they actually ran up a bill on that cruise ship and just said, screw it, I'm getting off, and that's it. They never get back on. You know, I would not be surprised if they really tried to do that too. It's like screw the cruise line and and just ran up a whole giant bill. Okay. Oh, so now now here's another one. Another thing that you're gonna like, I'm not like. So if you don't know, I had another video. Actually, I did, I I did like three three videos on this, right? So I did the video. So it's the port of Labadee, which is in Haiti, right? So please go watch it. It's actually I have a video, I and then I have two updates. So please do go watch it, and, and those updates are actually are, are good and everything. And what happened is. I mean, the, so I found out that the gangs are like taking control of that area, and there's a lot of you know crazy stuff going on over there. An entire jail, have, uh, everybody from the jail broke out of jail. I'm not even lying to. You. It was four thousand criminals that broke out of jail. Obviously, something had to happen. Something on the inside, you know. Maybe a little money going through here, money going there, but something did happen to get four thousand criminals onto the street. And now, now, at first, you know, they're like, "Oh yeah, we're not going to cancel anything." Then they start off with they cancel the excursions. 
Then after they cancel excursion, now they they won't even go there because they because it's gotten so out of control over there. And also people um, who go to Amber Cove are also getting worried, which not for nothing. That's where I'm going. So I will be going on a cruise to Amber Cove, but you know I know it's like about like 200. No, no, it's actually 150 miles away. Amber Cove is 150 miles away from the Elma. Wow, four people on the, on the Twitter side. Thank you for all for joining in. I mean, I don't know who else is on there. So if you're on the Twitter, please say hello. Um, if you haven't yet, yeah. So, so that's what it is. So, with Labby, it got so out of control that now, uh, so Labby is a private area in Haiti that only on uh, Royal Caribbean has. But the only thing is, unlike all, all the other cruise ships, all the other destinations that these cruise ships have that are private, this is the only one that's not on an island. So it's in, it's in the area of the island of Haiti. So if it gets really bad, where actually somehow it goes into the um, DR, more than likely that's when that's when you have to think about maybe Amber Cove and the port of Amber Cove will be closed. You don't have to worry about La Romana. That's all the way on the other side. So, and at that point, the DR is probably going to have their military come there and and, and you know expect it. That when that does happen, if if that if it comes to that, a lot of people are going to uh, probably die. I mean, you know, <laughs> I just don't want to scare you, but you know, the, not the not the obviously not the cruise passengers, but you know, obviously the cruises won't even be going there if if it gets to that. So I just got from Africa, felt very safe there. I'm having to lap the next, so I'm keeping an eye on the situation. Yeah. Uh, so Chris, um. I'm going to expect and do expect that the port, if you're going to Labrador, it's probably going to be canceled. I mean, so do you know the exact date that you're, you're going to be in Labrador? Like how many weeks away? Because I know the next set. So what they're going to do is the next seven weeks and then the next, the next seven days, anything go to Labrador is canceled. And then what's going to happen there, right? After after that is they're gonna do a rollover effect. So anyone who's going to Labd, they're gonna say you're gonna get a notice three days in advance that will let you know if the port is open, if it's canceled, and or if you're gonna to go to a different port or you just stick it out in the middle of the ocean. So you're going in June. I mean, it's only March, April, May, June. There's a possibility that by June it should be fixed, but you know, just obviously. Obviously, if you know, I will have the news out there. But <clears throat> if, if as soon as I find out that that Royal Caribbean is going back there, I would definitely let you know. I will let everybody know and all that. And uh, thank you, Emily, for coming in. Let me say hello. <clears throat> hey there, Key. You'll be there in June. Hello, fellow cruisers. Okay. So I did that. Oh, okay. So now I want to know everybody's opinion on this. Okay, please. Uh, so for some reason, a rich guy has uh, has this ambition. I always say rich. He's like a billionaire. I think from Australia has this ambition that he wants to build. Oh, did I put it here? Okay, here we go. That he wants to build the Titanic 2. I mean, look at it. Okay, that's what he would. And he wants to obviously have another one for rich people. I mean, he wants to make it exactly like this Titanic one. He wants to make it for the wealthy people around the world. And what's going to happen on this one? There's going to be a scam and all the richest people that they they, they want to knock off to the world. They're going to have them sink it to the bottom of the ocean again. I mean, nah, nah. I would... First of all, no no ship could, should ever be named the Titanic because of what happened. But also remember, Titanic is not the only cruise ship that actually has sunk. I think it was it was in Greece. I did a story a, cu a couple of weeks, maybe like a month ago, uh, <clears throat> where a cruise ship was it sunk like in the early two thousands. But now people are getting upset because the cruise ship was filled with gas and oil, and they're worried. 
that that all that's going to eventually start to leak into the ocean. So they're worried about that. So I don't know what they're going to do with, about that part. Okay, let's get back to the comments. Ooh. Okay. Uh oh. Okay, here we go. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. I got a super sticker, my first one. Yes, I'm allowed to get super stickers, everybody. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And my wife is the first one to send me a super sticker. She sent me five. Uh, <laughs> don't know how to, how to cash it out, but I'll eventually find out. This risk guy is crazy, in my opinion. Definitely, definitely crazy. I mean, why would you... To, I mean, why would you want to um, name it Titanic 2? I mean, no way, bad juju. <clears throat> Definitely bad juju. I mean, I would never go on the. I don't care if it's a free cruise. Tell me, oh, it's free. Come on. Yeah, I'll go on it. Just let, let it stay docked. I'll do my video, and I'll get off. And then after it gets off, that's it. I just don't want it to sail out because it's it, – Go on a ship. That's the name of Titanic. It should, like everyone's going to say, it's bad luck. It's bad juju. Just don't do it. I would not even go. I wouldn't even go for free. I don't care. You know, you, you could tell me it's a free world cruise. It's not happening. You know, free world cruise, you're going to say you're going to pay all my bills. So I come back. Everything's paid off. Nah. Because you know what? I know what, what's going to happen is it's going to go down. So, and that's a bad juju. So, nope, that's not a way I, I want to go. I love cruises, but I won't go on a cruise named Titanic. Sorry. And then, you know what's funny? All the, I, I actually looked it up one time. All these years, I thought Titanic in iceberg in, in Alaska. But it wasn't Alaska. That's the funny part. I All these years, I my entire life, I thought I thought that. Okay, congratulations on receiving super stickers. Yep, yep, definitely. Thank you, Emily. And, you know, just need another 947 hours to go till I get to the 4,000. And then I am fully monetized. So I got the baby monetization part, which I had the subscribers. <laughs> I'm just not getting the hours. I mean, that's also because I put out a lot of shorts. So. At some point, probably within the next week, I probably will hit. <laughs> this is a really, really crazy mark. Is five hundred thousand views on my channel? I'm not kidding. So, yep, you, you, you're shocked. But I'm gonna hit five hundred thousand views on my channel probably within the next week, two weeks max. So, because I'm, I'm already, I'm over four hundred nine thousand already. So I'm already. I think I, I'm literally at like 409,000 and change. Uh-oh. Okay, let's get to this. I will not go, nor will I tell people. No way, Jose. So, Eddie, welcome to the party. For your, your Brooklyn in the house. So, since you're here, let me, I want to ask your opinion on this real quick. Would you go on a cruise ship named Titanic 2, even if it was free? I wouldn't. I'm telling you, we're all saying it's just bad juju. It's bad luck, a bad name. I, I just wouldn't do it. You know, I I, I, I said that I, what I would do is let's stay docked. I'll do my filming and I'll get off before it goes. Hey, so let's see what go. And happy St. Patrick's Day weekend. My wife now sent me $2. Wow. Thank you. I I should really su su make something. So, yep, yeah, I am allowed to receive super stickers. I got, all right, I got 17 people. You know, it's funny. I got, I got six people watching on, on the TikTok side. Okay, so that's the type of oh. All right, so since we are all here, so if you don't know, so th there's been a big trending story this week, which I did not want to make a video on it because I don't like to make videos on, other YouTubers, other content creators, just because sometimes I go off and I don't want to, you know, knock or say something that I don't. And plus, you know, it's I, I just feel like it's not right to make actual like a cruise and put them in the news, you know, because you know, you know that's their channel and everything. But 
But in the, in the live streams, I will talk about all the channels if if it's big enough to be in the news. Like this is big enough to be in the news. So if you ever heard of the Ben and da you ever heard of Ben and David? They're a big big um your um England. They're a big big cruise um channel from England, right? So they're a couple two men, right? And they do really really good work. But from what I've been told, they they come in with some serious camera equipment. I mean. I'm people think people saying that it costs money. This camera, I mean, I mean, but it's two of them. So you know, one's can filming the other, vice versa, and all that. But so they were they were booked on the MSC Europa, right? So on that ship, on the MSC Europa, they booked in the the suites, which is called the Yacht Club, if I am correct. All right. So let me just pause this real quick, and then, and then I'm gonna do this. Yeah. I am also going to, as soon as I go off, I am going to put a poll up. Actually, I'm going to put a poll on, on the Facebook group. Uh, let me read first, then I'll, I'll tell you, because you guys are getting confused. Yo, yo, Eddie. Okay, hello. Eddie says, Miller. Hey, Eddie. Okay. I kind of read that I went to some person's original. They had a restaurant. They're called the, the Olympic, right? A replica of the dining room from the Titan using artifacts of, the, oh, my God. I, See, I didn't even know that. I mean, Eddie says he was going to heartbeat. Uh, I don't know. It's just bad luck. Me, me, me neither. Because I believe it's been taken out of proportion. There's more to the story and full taking advantage of the situation. Okay. So I'm going to make a poll. See if anyone would go if we have the mic. Curious to see what people would say. Yeah, I am definitely going to. I'm, I'm actually going to do that too. Once I once I'm done with this live stream, I'm, I'm gonna go on the YouTube, make a poll. I'm gonna put a thing on my Facebook group. So if, also, if you haven't joined, please join the Facebook group page. Right now, I have 80 people on there, but I have oh, see, I have 80 people on the group Facebook group, but I, only, but I have 2,200 followers on YouTube. I mean, can you guys like go over, go over there, try to get a little more action there too? But do not watch it on Facebook. Watch it on the YouTube. Get me those watch hours. I said, uh, okay, yeah, I said. So, okay, so back to the Ben and David. Sorry. So what happened now? There. So they went on there at the yacht club. Like I think around day three or four, they were told to stop filming. Right. They asked if they could use their cell phone because they understand that they have really, really big equipment. Like it's almost like media equipment right so their equipment costs more than than the car from my from just from what, what everybody all these content creators have been saying right so so they were told to stop filming so at that point they got really pissed off because they wouldn't even let them film with their cell phones but other people are on there film filming taking pictures with their cell phone so they they got targeted obviously at that point and what they did is they didn't want to say no more. They just got up at the next port. They they took all their stuff and they left. And then they uh, they got on a plane and they went home. And then after that, they made a video. And for I've been told, in one day of that video, they had over two hundred thousand views on that one video. So so having a video like that of that amount that, that is like that's crazy. You know, two hundred thousand. <laughs> I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean, I, I jump when I get excited as soon as soon if I get a thousand, I get really, really excited. You know, about two hundred thousand. Whoo. Where we at? Yeah, see, nine hundred fifty-one views on that on my on my video that's actually been like been taken off. Oh yeah, I have a short too, everybody. That's got like 30, 30, uh, 30, 500 views right now. So uh, I put out yesterday. So that one's jumping a little bit. And obviously, let's see what's going on here. Okay, so we got 21 views on the live stream right now, everybody. And my latest video, 53 views. But like I said, probably tomorrow that one will jump on jump up. Like hopefully, it jumps up to <laughs> to where this one, is, the other one was, like the the 900 views. But I'm happy if it does like above like 300 views. That's why I'm happy. And he says, I'm happy every time we get 100 views on a vlog or short. So, what I start. 
Master Joe, 200 views, that's chump chains. I mean, 200 views, think about it. I mean, so they did that in one day. It took me a little bit over a year to get 500,000 views. Forget about it. You know, you know how much money they made on that one video? I mean, they didn't care about getting off that shit. Once they made that video, they they, they oh, forget about it. They, they made a boatload of money on that video. Tell them, Scott. I'm happy every time I get a single view on the video, never mind 200,000. Yeah. I mean, like, like, oh, I want my videos to be at least like 300 views and above. If it's below 300, 300 views, then I, I always start to look at what can I do better? What am I doing wrong? Maybe it was my thumb there. But also remember, sometimes it's just, it's just a story. Sometimes I put the story out. It's just not a big story. So if the story is not a big story, not everybody wants to see, you know, a little a little dink of story. Everybody wants, uh, not for nothing. When it comes to the news, yes, so it's kind of sad. But people want to see the bad stories. When I say the bad stories, like this one. Oh, the woman get killed on a cruise ship. Someone jumps off a cruise ship. These are what these, those are the ones that get you the more views. So they want to see those cruise stories. I mean, I don't like to do it, but <clears throat> I'm not going to not do it, you know. And I'm going to give my honest opinion and also. And, and and plus, you know, anytime I go on a ship, I'm going to give you an honest opinion on all my stuff on the cruise ship. A cruise ship, if they come up to me one day and tell me, oh, yeah, I want you to do this and that, I'm not going to. I'll give you a free cruise. I'm like, you can give me the free cruise, but I'm still going to give you my honest opinion, the good and the bad, which is how it should always be. But I, that's the one that I, there, there are times that I heard that the cruise lines pay people. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just had, uh, there are times that, that the cruise lines will pay people to go on the cruises because they want them just to say everything good. So I'm watching a content creator, which I was actually watching someone that was on the Venezia um, before. Us. Every video they said was something uh, <laughs> was always good. I didn't hear one negative thing. So if I'm watching a content creator and I and you you're going to give reviews and I don't hear, I don't hear you say not one negative thing. Guess what I do? I give you a chance, give you a couple of views, and then I shut you off because I'm not going to watch anyone who doesn't give negative reviews because then you are not honest. Okay, uh, TikTok get more more views in an hour. Yeah, well. See, the thing with TikTok, I'm starting to grow it, but what I'm doing on TikTok is, you know, they have a thing on TikTok where you can promote your videos on TikTok. So that's actually been helping also. Uh, my wife walks in. She wants to open up the window. I mean, watch this. She opens up the window. The fire trucks are going to come by. You all you all have heard it. Fire trucks go, woo, woo. They all come by. Okay, so I'm still at, at – okay. So I'm still at the um, – Ben and Davis. So tell me what you think. Um, was MSC right? I mean, because remember, they are in the Yacht Club, which is a expensive Yacht Club. Obviously, Scott has been in the Yacht Club. Oh, oh, someone's here. See? 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 see. Said hi. <laughs> oh, you, now you said hi. Said hi. <laughs> yeah. Cruising with keys. Yep. Cruising with keys. Yeah. They, they, <laughs> Thank you for the uh, the stickers. The super chats. Yeah, yeah super chats. I, 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 are you calling stickers? I mean, I don't know. They're called stickers, I guess. Stickers, super chats. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. What they call? They work. Yeah. Scott Mustard Drew. Drama and sex sells. Yeah. Drama and sex does sell, and which is sad. No, it's the, it's the news. I mean, I mean, it's the truth. Like, like. I don't like to talk about it, but it's supposed to be a family channel. <laughs> MC gave them my money. That's what I heard. I haven't actually seen the video, but I did hear from another content creator who has actually told me that they did get their money back. But you know, I mean, not for nothing. What what was that going to do? What I would have done to promise them is that I would have actually offered them to come back onto the cruise ship, and I would give them. The free groups because giving them the money is one thing I, I would just actually give them the money and get them to come back on a free cruise and tell them you can say whatever you want you know and then you know put them 
in the yacht club, give them like the, the, the royal treatment, let them get massages every day because this it's not, it's not like okay, you're having me do it. I have two thousand these people have like two hundred like fifty thousand followers. This is gonna either make or break you sometimes, you know. Jojo, Joanne, be careful with that Momo. I know. I know. Pa apparently, Keith, there is an email about MSC giving them a free cruise, and they refused it. Yep. Okay. See, that I did not know. Okay, mustard. They got their money back. They offered another free cruise, and MSC is going to re retrain the crew, and Ben and David, David offer content. For the train. That's good. That to get their money back and come back on the cruise boat. Yeah. So that's something. So, yeah, we got that part. Oh, okay. Wow. 757 already? Okay. I didn't even realize the time, but okay. This is okay. Wait, I have another sheet coming up. Where's my other sheet? Up for. Well, tomorrow's, uh, I guess I'm going to have to go online. Okay, so I am actually going to, um, I have two cruise news stories, right? I thought I wrote down then what I was talking about. Uh, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, I do have it. Yeah, so my one new cruise news story, it's actually a good one, is about um, a, a rescue mission. So... So the, the U.S. Coast, the Coast Guard performed, oh, okay, so U.S. Coast Guard. The U.S. Coast Guard performs a, a, a passenger evacuation ship from a Royal Caribbean ship. So that's one new story that I'm going to do. Um, I'm not sure. I am I don't know how. I. You might not get it till Sunday, so I'm going to try to get it out before then. But tomorrow after, tomorrow after work, I'm going to my brother's house. And then uh, obviously it's uh, and then we're gonna have the St. Patrick's Day dinner, so my mother's gonna be here. And then Sundays is the day I, I will be able to film. So um, unless I film it tonight, <laughs> but you know I might not want to film it tonight only because at nine o'clock I'm probably gonna watch the the um, the live stream with the Mustro and Eddie. So I'm gonna I may be able. To, uh, as long as I'm able, I have enough time to film it, but I'm not going to put it where then I can edit it tomorrow. So if, if I'm able to do that, then that would be perfect. What? See, my wife opens it. I, I'm, I'm hearing bells outside of my house. I mean, how is there a church? Church is like a half a mile from here. It's Friday night, man. I mean, I can hear the church bells. I This is the first time I ever heard these church bells ever. Yeah. Oh, my wife says I should go to the church. You know what happened if I walked into the church? Oh, oh, my God. No, all right, no, not time to say good night. You, you, good night to you, all right? But that too, get their money back and come back to our cruise. Yeah, it's too bad. MEC shut down initially. I saw the review and it was actually pretty positive, which have been. Which would have been a good PR for them. Yep. I actually read the story. I'm in isolation now. My mom sent me the story. Okay, and happy St. Patrick's Day, everybody. Okay, so where was that? See? Oh, okay, so the Coast Guard. So that's where I'm going. That's the one story. And the other one, like I said, these stories sell. And what happened with the other one, which. It was weird. I did not see it until today. So it's a, the story was put out on March 11th. I know today is the 14th, no, 15th, right? So I, 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 I must have missed the story, but I am going to get it out there. So a passenger was arrested on, a, on the Royal Caribbean Explorer of the Seas for a lewd and last survey. Oh, my God. Loss of us conduct on a cruise ship sauna. So it's, I mean, it's a 21 year old from Georgia, and I don't think he's obviously from Georgia here. I think it's from the actual country Georgia. 
and supposedly he was doing something with a 14 year old boy in the sauna so that's like that's not a good look for roy right now so that's a, that's a really really bad look and yep yep and do not forget to join the, at nine o'clock come over chat with the usual suspects i guess uh oh so so, so that's done so the, I guess it's not the 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 after dark is canceled tonight. I guess I do. Yeah, I mean, okay, and that's up. Did that that and that's everything. Yeah, all garbage. Thank you, and I I have more things. I always write. I always have a notebook. My notebook's right here. Look, now it's eight oh two, everybody, and. We are definitely gonna call it a night in a minute. Let me just check the Instagram. Who's uh, everybody else? Who's there? Okay, I'm gonna let's end the Instagram part. Okay, okay. So A writes go live together, Keith. 9 p.m. tonight. Okay. So okay. So I want to thank everybody for coming. In. Yeah. So, so Emily. So the notebook is whenever I do my my news stories, I'm always writing things out, notes and everything. So on every news story that I write out, so that when I film it, <clears throat> I have the notes. Yes. I now. Yes, I know the Instagram has been disconnected and. Ah, uh, yeah, finally. Okay, so I want to thank everybody for coming in. And, oh, I almost forgot to announce. So next Friday, I'm supposed to have a guest on here, right? So you guys all have seen him. He has a live stream. I know he does it with Bill. So give you the suspense for a second. And it's a controversial cruising. So I spoke to him. So he's supposed to come here on, on the show next Friday, but obviously if, if things don't work out, obviously it'll be just me. So next Friday, Controversial Cruising will be on, on the live. So, and we are going to talk about his channel and everything. And, you know, hopefully eventually I'm, I'm also looking to do another live stream, but not a weekly thing, maybe a monthly or bi-weekly thing. So I'm actually going to have to contact some other creators. I just haven't, I had the time to actually start to contact a couple people because I'm looking to maybe get. Uh, so when I do that, it's going to be more of like we're going to talk about the big. So if it's bi bi weekly or monthly, we're going to talk about the big stories of of the of the the last two weeks or of the month, right? So vice versa. I haven't decided yet. So and I'm just looking to get like maybe a couple of people in there with me. So that's what I'm looking for. So. If you're interested, please message me, and that's it. So um, I want to thank you, everybody, for coming in. And do not forget, until next time, everybody, safe travels. Ciao. Okay, and I'm not dancing this time. Oh, see. Good day, mate. And I, I'm, I'm shutting up the – I'm closing the stream. Sorry. Um, I don't know. Down on the cruise, but – Everett.